What's up, guys? I'm here with me. <laughs> I have to wear this cap so he doesn't look too much taller than me. <laughs> how you doing, man? I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. So, the day after, how does the eviction feel? I feel I feel happy to be out because um, it's been a long process for me just being in a certain place and not knowing what to do or what's going on and stuff. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure you didn't plan on staying in the house for just two weeks. Of course, of you course. Know. So, do you feel disappointed? I mean, you say you're happy now because you can't wait to see your family, but yeah. do you feel like maybe you didn't play your game as well as you could? Yeah, um, I really didn't expect to be out in just two weeks. I wasn't really expecting to go like to the final also, but I wanted to like play a game whereby I um, showed the world the whole part of me. Yeah, yeah. A day after, have you looked back and said, maybe this was why it was, or this was why it was? Yeah, yeah. I think um, a couple of questions kept on coming while I was in the house. Like the fact that Big Brother asked me the fact that uh, me being married has he downplayed my game and stuff. And now that I'm out, I think, yeah, a little bit because for the first week, I kept on having this whole marriage conversation. <laughs> But I think if I still had a chance to go back, I wouldn't have changed anything. The World Cup thing, do you think it affected your game? I mean, you went to the World Cup. Yeah. But the vibe in the house was very weird that first because people mm. were just trying to figure things out. Yeah. Do you think it also probably made you not be as expressive as you could have been if it was just a regular week? Yes, so with the white card thing, I was really curious and I really wanted us to find out the white card thing because I didn't want to know what the disadvantages were. Mm -hmm. I kind of felt like we had this thing with us and let's figure it out. And I, I noticed that I was the one reaching out to people and very curious. I hope you're doing your assignments to find out this thing. Person. But it just felt like I'm the only guy who was so interested. Then later on, I found out that Perry was also doing the same thing, but you know, he was a white card, of course. Yeah, he needed to do something. <laughs> Were you surprised? I was surprised. Who did you get along with the least, you think? The least? Ooh. I think the least would be me. I really didn't get time to, you know, figure her out and talk to her. Though I knew that we had, you know, a place of. Um, where we were coming from was kind of similar. So, and of course, you're married. I know that you probably went into the house without any intentions or doing anything with any girl. Yeah. But did you feel a certain vibe from any of the girls that maybe I'm glad that this girl like me? Like I just honestly, with any girls that look like they might have liked you. You know, I really didn't want to pay so much attention into that. I think they might be, or they might have not been, or they might be playing a game. But I was more cautious of trying not to lead anybody on in any way that I wouldn't want to. Who do you think is going to win? Yeah, so I have top three. I think Sasuke. Sasuke, she's oh. a very strong character. I think White Money is a strong character. I was thinking about um, um, Saga, but I think with the new housemates, Saga might have a problem. Why? Because uh, his game is just he, Saga is in the in the place whereby he's being covered up, so he has like he has like a fortress covering him up, and he's just like that, you know, diamond shell in in there. And um, now that we have two guys in the house, and Nini is obviously she says she, before <laughs> I left she was seeing some things, trying some advances real quick. Then I think that might shake Saga up as a man. So what's next for you? You talked about business. I know you also have a base outside of Nigeria. Yeah. So this business is it going to be here? Is it going to be there? What other things? Well, my business, my business is actually here. My office is in Calabar. And uh, when I mean business, I mean I love entertainment. So entertainment business, you know, anything entertainment that we can convert to business is business for me. So yeah, I'm open to anything. I really want to explore a lot of options for myself. I know I have different sides I'm yet to explore and I can't wait to bring that up. Good luck man. I like the fact that you did this because money is important. Yeah, it's good, it's good, it's good. <laughs> That's how we do all the work we do. Yeah. All the best man. Thank you very much. Thank and, uh, you. See you doing great things in the future. Thank you very much. Yeah.